And welcome to, uh, to this construction building site. We're actually sponsored here today by Habitat for Humanity. Well, this is the, uh, the sixth year in a row in which the uh, cooperatives have come together and actually helped give something back to the community during the course of NREC's annual meeting. We've got Middle Tennessee Electric um, Cooperative that's actually been involved with us in this particular construction event. But we have close to 120 volunteers today helping to put up houses like this. A huge step for a community we're in today. Helping people who um, are, are, are getting a starter who need help in a way like this is, is very meaningful to, to me personally. It means something to our employees. We've got more than 20 of our own folks who are here today. So um, yeah, it's important to us. Habitat for Humanities is an organization that basically helps um, families that are in need of purchasing a home, becoming homeowners for the first time. You know, so we're all out here helping this particular family. We are extremely blessed and fortunate to uh, meet every one of you uh, to have y'all come out here and help us uh, build a home for our family. It really gets back to two core fundamental principles of cooperatives. The first one obviously is commitment to community. We are from and for the people. That leads to our roots. And so this is a great expression of that commitment to community. We have co-ops all over the country coming together, that's another cooperative principle, cooperation among cooperatives, to help these folks who are building their habitat homes to actually help make that dream a reality. It is a mixture of several different states that is actually here today. We've got people from as far away as Alaska and Florida that are all coming together for a national meeting of the Electric Cooperative Association, and we're all here to pitch in and make something happen. I mean, it makes me cry with happiness because you have so many folks who put others before themselves out here, but they're doing it because it's part of our value system, and it's just neighbor help and neighbor, and we're one big happy family, and, and we believe in helping other people. A few years ago, I was in the investor-owned utility world and had a chance to come into the co-op world. Uh, that transition's been different in the sense that uh, it's just more family-orientated. People, people look out for each other, they've got their back, and I think that's very important. Uh, we're just pleased to be here today to, to give back to this community. Coming to the annual convention was a great way, it is a great way to give back to the Nashville area. It makes me feel good. It makes me feel good and also show everybody that we can be leaders also outside of work and put our hands and feet. We're not just pretty women in the office. We can also do a man's job outside of work. So. That was good. <laughs> Uh, just looking at the hard work today, you have to be inspired. Today, we're making a home, a reality for a family that truly deserves it. They've all thanked us for letting us let them come here, but when in reality, you know, we're the ones who are very grateful and thankful. So.